What if Goku and Broly were sent to planet Earth? How would this impact Dragon Ball Z Part 10? If you're not a subscriber, what are you waiting for? Subscribe now and make sure you click that bell so you'll be the first to know about any new Dragon Ball Z discussion what if I make. Hey everybody, welcome back to this week's episode of Dragon Ball Z Discussion, where we do a what if discussion on Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball Super, and Dragon Ball GT. Previously, on what if Goku and Broly were sent to planet Earth, we mentioned that Beerus the Destroyer has now woken up as he prophesies of fighting a very strong foe. From there, Beerus decided to go to planet Earth. King Kai warned Goku and Broly about Beerus as he has arrived and from there they try their best to calm him down, but he lost his temper when Majin Buu refused to give him pudding. Beerus then went and he started to beat the shit out of Buu as all the Z fighters came and he knocked all them down including Vegeta. Goku went and he started to fight Beerus as he managed to go and unlock his autonomous ultra instinct. Beerus went and he used his 100% power as he managed to overpower Goku and from there Broly came and he transformed to his legendary Super Saiyan as he was going head to head with Beerus and he managed to hold his own against Beerus. Beerus felt he was being overpowered and from there he went and he tried to Hawkeye Broly. Goku went and he began to scream as he has now finally mastered his ultra instinct. Master Ultra Instinct Goku came right in front of Beerus as he went and punched him really hard and he kicked his ass as Beerus didn't stand a chance against Master Ultra Instinct Goku. Whis then came and offered Goku and Broly to come and train with him at Beerus' world. Vegeta also begged him to train and from there all three of them now went to Beerus' world and their training has begun. What if Goku and Broly were sent to Planet Earth Part 10. Goku, Broly, and Vegeta began their training as they were training every day trying to get stronger while doing a lot of chores. Whis managed to go and get them a lot stronger. Gohan on the other hand went to Supreme Kai's world and he continued getting stronger as he wanted to go and reach Goku and Broly's level. While Goku was training, he then went to Gohan and he brought him to Whis as Whis looked at Gohan and from there he agreed to let Gohan come and train since Gohan gave him such an amazing food. And from there all four Saiyans were training with Whis trying to get stronger. While all that was happening, back on Earth, Frieza's man has come to Earth as they went and used the Dragon Balls and from there they have revived Frieza to come back to life. While bringing Frieza back, they decided to go and make the Frieza Force a lot stronger and to do that they decided to go and wish back another foe who can help Frieza to go and kill Goku which was Cell. They then went and used a last wish to ask to bring Cell back to life so that him and Frieza can team together and kill Goku and Broly. Once when they revived Cell and Frieza, both of them were badly damaged as they went and put Frieza back inside the healing chamber and from there he came out. Once when he came out, they then told Frieza everything about Goku and Broly as Frieza saw Cell and from there he said, What the fuck is that? Who is this guy? My lord, he is Cell. He put up a very good fight with Goku and Broly and since we all hate Goku, I decided to bring him back so he can kill them too. I cannot allow some random cunt to join me. <laughs> Hold your horses Frieza, I am Cell and I'm willing to work alongside with you so I can get my revenge unless you want to fight me. As Cell went and he used his golden form. Frieza looked at Cell as he was very impressed and from there he said, hmm, very well, let's work together and end those monkeys once and for all. But first, let's train. Since I'm completely outclassed, I need to get a lot stronger. Hmm, sounds good to me, Frieza. 
as Frieza and Cell decide to go and train with each other for one year. One year has passed since Frieza and Cell were revived and they went on a training spree. Both of their power level has increased big time as they were ready to go and get their revenge. While that was happening, Goku, Vegeta, Broly and Gohan has all gained something called God Key. As Broly was able to use his full potential power thanks to Whis and Vegeta was trying his best to catch up to Goku and Broly while Gohan was able to use Super Saiyan God mixed with his mystic form. They kept pushing towards new height and new power while Beerus was impressed to see just how powerful these Saiyans has got. Frieza and Cell has now arrived on Earth as everyone says their enormous power level and from there they all went and made their way towards it. Once when the Z fighters got there, they saw Frieza's spaceship has arrived as the door opened and from there they saw Frieza came out as everyone was very scared of his power level and from there Krillin said, What? What is he doing here? They all saw Cell as he came out and he said, <laughs> Yes Earthling, I have come back to haunt you yet again. Gohan and everyone kept training. And from there Supreme Kai came to visit Beerus' world as Gohan saw him and from there he asked him if he can take him to Earth because he wanted to go and see Videl. Supreme Kai went and Kai Kai'd Gohan to Earth but once when Gohan got to Earth, Supreme Kai and Gohan sensed enormous power level coming from the west as Gohan went there and once when he got there, he looked at Frieza and Cell and said, What the? What are you doing here? And am I missing something? Frieza and Cell working together? Oh, if it isn't Gohan, I remember you cunt. Your father, where is he? Hmm, <laughs> tell me where that bastard Broly is. The only one you'll be facing is me. As Gohan went and he powered up and he rushed at Cell and their battle began. Gohan attacked him rapidly as Cell wasn't phased by Gohan's power and from there he dodged all of his attack. Gohan then went and tried to uppercut Cell, but Cell went and decked him in the stomach really hard. Gohan then went and he screamed. <laughs> As he transformed to his mystic Super Saiyan God. He then went and charged at Cell, as Cell was holding his own against Gohan and from there he said, Very impressive Gohan, let's see what you got. Frieza came from the back and he punched Gohan really hard, as Gohan fell to the ground and from there, Boma started to panic, as she didn't know what to do and she was trying to call Whis. Gohan got up, as both Frieza and Cell came together and they teamed up against Gohan, as he was trying to manage to hold his own against him. Supreme Kai quickly kai kai back to Beerus' world as he said, Guys, there's trouble! Frieza and Cell has resurrected! What? Supreme Kai, let's go! As Goku, Broly, and Vegeta all went right back to Earth. Cell and Frieza were ganging up on Gohan as they were about to go for the finishing blow, but from there Goku and Broly has arrived along with Vegeta as they stopped what they were doing and they focused on Goku. <laughs> Looks like the little pitch has finally arrived. Very nice to see you, Goku. And I see that's Broly. <laughs> I remember you. I killed you in Namek. <laughs> we will see who dies this time, Frieza. As Broly instant transmission right in front of Frieza. And from there, he started to beat the shit out of him. Frieza was very mad as he went and he tried to attack Broly. But Broly dodged all of Frieza's attack as he went and started to squeeze Frieza. Frieza managed to go and free himself as he said, How the fuck are you this strong? Frieza, you forgot about me? Vegeta went in. Uh <laughs> Seeing that got Frieza and Cell really surprised as Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta went and he flew towards Frieza and he started to attack him. Cell looked at Vegeta and he said, <laughs> You're pathetic Vegeta, is this all you got? Vegeta went and he rushed at Cell as he tried to attack him but from there, Frieza came and he decked him really hard in the stomach as he spat out blood and from there Cell came and kicked him really hard in the neck 
causing Vegeta to pass out and he lost his Super Saiyan Blue. Goku and Broly saw that Cell and Frieza has got a lot stronger, as both of them looked at each other and from there they said, Now, let us show you my true power! Cell went and he transformed to his golden form. Frieza went and he transformed to his golden form. What do you think, Goku? Now that we have trained together, you don't stand a chance against me or Frieza. Hmm, is that so? As Goku went and he uses Autonomous Ultra Instinct. Hmm, you don't stand a chance against us. Both of you will die again. Broly went and he screamed. <laughs> As he transformed to his legendary Super Saiyan, and they had a stare down. From there, Broly went and he charged at Frieza, while Goku went towards Cell and their battle began. Goku and Cell were going at it, while Frieza and Broly were going at it too. Cell was holding his own against Goku, while Frieza was holding his own. From there, they started to attack back, while Goku dodged all of Cell's attack. He then went and tried to punch him in his stomach, but Cell caught his fist and he kicked Goku really hard, while Broly went and he powered up an eraser cannon and he threw it at Frieza. Frieza crushed the eraser cannon like it was nothing as he came right in front of Broly and both of their fists clashed with one another. Goku at his autonomous ultra instinct was holding Cell off as Cell got mad and he said, You're pathetic Goku, this power won't kill me like last time, now let me end this! As Cell went and he powered up to his full, while Frieza went and he started to overpower Broly and he screamed. Frieza has now used 100% of his golden power. As he went and he decked Broly really hard and he started to kick Broly's ass. Goku and Cell were going at it. As full power Cell went and he started to overpower Goku and he punched him in his stomach and kicked him in his face as Goku started to bleed from his nose and he said, Hmm, this is amazing. I see you're powerful, Cell. Even in my autonomous ultra instinct, you're standing a chance against me. <laughs> what do you expect, Goku? I trained for this day. As Cell went and he uppercut Goku as Goku flew 5 meters away and he landed right in the ground. Frieza went and punched Broly really hard as Broly fell to the ground and from there both Goku and Broly got up as they were standing side by side and Frieza and Cell looked at them and they said, now let's end this once and for all. Yes, I want to kill these buckers once and for all. Let's do it, Cell. <clears throat> this is amazing. I love how powerful you guys are. But you're forgetting one thing. We haven't been sitting around watching God Tooth. We have been trading ourselves. Hmm. <clears throat> Allow us to show you our training. Let's do it, brother. <clears throat> you got it, brother. Goku and Broly went and they began to transform. Broly looked at Goku and he said, Goku, let me handle this. I want to kill them myself, please. Huh? <laughs> sure, Broly. You can have this one. As Goku stand down and he was watching the battle. Broly has transformed to a Super Saiyan Blue Legendary Super Saiyan as everyone couldn't believe just how powerful Broly was. Goku was very impressed as he said, Oh my gosh, Broly! This is amazing! <laughs> I never knew you could mix your God Key with your Legendary Super Saiyan. Now this is something I want to see. Now, who wants to die first? As Cell came and he tried to punch Broly, but Broly went and he ripped Cell's arm off as all blood sprayed everywhere and from there Broly went and kicked him really hard. 
Frieza came and he charged at Broly, while Broly caught Frieza by the neck and he said, You will always be a pussy! Now it's time for you to die! Cell came from behind and he threw a massive Kamehameha wave at Broly as he dropped Frieza and from there he flew towards Cell as he went right in front of the Kamehameha wave and he walked right through it. Seeing that got Cell very scared as Cell got worried and he said, What the? You're a monster! What are you? Cell tried to run away but Broly instant transmission right in front of him and Broly went and he used his Omega Blast and he threw it at Cell as his body disintegrated and he died right there. Frieza went and he threw a blast trying to destroy Earth but the Goku came from behind and he kicked him very hard as he flew towards Broly and from there Broly went and used an eraser cannon and he threw it at Frieza as Frieza exploded to a million of pieces and from there he has died too. Broly with his new legendary Super Saiyan Blue proved to be too much for Frieza and Cell as he has won the battle and from there the Z fighters ran towards Broly to celebrate as they were very surprised and excited by Broly's new power and from there they are all enjoying their time while Frieza and Cell went right back to hell. Find out what happens in the next episode of what if Goku and Broly were sent to planet earth. Make sure you click the bell my Z fans so you'll be the first to know when the next episode comes out.